fuck? I, I, the, the fucking Xbox. I, uh, I hate having. I can't. I, I can't unpin. You know what sucks? I'm not signed into my. I'm not signed into my Microsoft account on my computer, right? So because of that, I can't permanently unpin stuff from my taskbar that I don't want pinned any there. That I don't want pinned down there if it's automatically there from the start. It's like a giant middle yeah. finger. So what was it? I try. I had to click something open real quick to end it. I fucking click on that because you have like the Xbox Connect or whatever the frick, and it's just like, why, why? I I I I've I've had that happen so many times where I'm like, oh, misclick, shit, and then it just keeps it's just there, and it's just like, no, I don't want that. I wanted the other thing. But anyway, how are you doing, Zig? I'm doing all right, you know. Um, getting shit done at work. You know, just doing all, all that sort of stuff. Talked about uh, Beetlejuice and whatnot with some co-workers and shit. That's how you do it. <laughs> you go around the water cooler. You see the latest yeah. movie that come out? Hey, did you see the latest movie that came out? What's the latest movie to come out? Is this gonna capture? Alien Romulus. Beetlejuice. Beetlejuice. Who wants to see Alien Romulus? I kind of do. I don't Let's like. It's like. I'm kind of burnt out after like the two crummy Alien movies we get. Okay, there we go. Cool. I just got it. Again, I just want to see if it. Like from what I've seen, it's can they still got, pull like, it off? Reviews. Yeah. Like I so like. I'm willing, to, I'm willing to give it a fucking chance. You know what I mean? No, like I, I don't, no, like I don't think that they can't. I don't think that they can't pull it off. I think that the problem with, um, it's just that it's like, all right, we went from, we went from like, oh, you know, mm, like this guy pretty strong. I think we've been over this before. We went from like pretty strong like space bugs to like fucking, oh, these things were these things are like the frailty of humanity mixed with like you know. Mixed with like freaking the the sci-fi trope of God is alien. Hmm. I don't know. God, that, is aliens. God is aliens. That's how it be. <laughs> like we keep like I don't know. For me, it's just like a. For me, it's just a tired freaking like. Looking at this chum trough makes me really happy. I grew up in a baking town instead of a fishing town. You gotta dip Looking yourself in it because you gotta get really the scent. I grew up in a oh, driftwood, so smooth. Okay, now. Wait, I think I know what I gotta do. Marshall Dune. Mm hmm. Wait a minute. Put the pits in the rock. What? Hey, do you know the answer to the riddle about the pits and rotten bed? What kind of pits are you talking about? What the fuck? Huh. Not sure. I need to enter the Maiden's Feast. Child, at this point, we... Search him along. I feel like I have to show him the hey, driftwood. Maybe that'll give him the idea. What? What about it? Maybe. May I please have it? Can I please have it? I like your manners, but I like my hat more. It might cost you the election. Hey, let's give you that one a shot, real hat. quick. What? What about it? But yeah, nah, it, like you said, it just tran it just transfers into like God is aliens. It might cost you the election. Please, whom am I to trust? My highly paid stylist or a girl wearing half a dress? You don't understand. I chopped up this dress. Those shell maidens won't share their monster bait with me. Please, that's terrible. I know. They won't give me a single drop. No, I mean it's terrible what a tattletale you are. You no gotta... perfume will cover up poor sportsmanship, young lady. You gotta dip yourself in the chum. Start from along better. Better let you get back to the feast. Yes, yes. These maidens aren't going to serve up themselves. So basically, we just got to figure out how to one finish constructing this place, and two get his stupid bucket hat. I got a feeling I know what I got. I have a feeling I know what I got to do with this. Hey, hey, buddy. 
Found some driftwood Cocoon. down by the beach. That's morbid. But at least it's natural and hasn't been perverted by you humans. That's morbid. What the fuck? That's morbid. At least it's natural and not been perverted by you humans. <laughs> Me and I cultural like I should literally just alien Romulus and Yeah, I'm just burnt out on it. Here she comes again. Hey. Oh, the dead eye god sees no one. I got some driftwood. Uh Can I go inside? You Is that the answer to, to your question? Our holiest of shrines? Why? Uh I don't really, if I'm being completely honest. Then be gone. Can I show you this piece of driftwood? Oh, driftwood. So smooth. Does driftwood ever have children? What? No. Hey, excuse me. I'm not a wood scientist. Why can't the riddle be something along the lines of, when I grow up, I want to be a tree? The solution <laughs> to your riddle is cloud shoes. We don't even know what those are, but no. <laughs> well, I'm shit out of luck here. We and I had a pretty normal fucking like school day. I had the annoying wait between like uh, two classes. Oh, like the long ass wait where you just sat the fucking uh, thing and shit. So it's just like, God damn, what do I do that around this time and what? Well, the, you know what was cool is the people weren't there. The people? The people at the- so the place I don't like going- the place I didn't want to go to in the school anymore, they're not there anymore. Hey, buddy. Well, I mean, it's been- I mean, it Check has it been out. like four years non talking wood. I wouldn't be surprised. Oh, and it's so smooth. Oh, man. I feel a stool coming on. What? <laughs> oh, um, whew. That's a relief. Tell me about it. I feel ten times better. Thanks for helping me get that out of my system. I want you to have it. Really? Thanks. No problem. I like to spread my samples around. Thank you, Elijah Wood. I mean, That's Riker. Will Wheaton. Thank you, Riker. <laughs> will Wheaton. Wesley. Re what? Shut up, Wesley. Yeah, right. <laughs> Forgot. <laughs> Shut up, Wesley. Thank you, Will Wheaton. Will Wheaton. What about Will Wheaton? He's the voice of this guy in this game. Yes. Hey, buddy. Look what I got. Sorry to do this to you, but... Oh my god. Is that... mutilated tree flesh? You see, what Curtis does is he peels off the outer layer of the wood... <laughs> ...to get to the tender stuff inside... <laughs> Then he dips the whole thing in an acid bath before he begins the deep carving. Oh, sorry, did that upset you? You monster! That's what I was looking for. Wow, it's getting thicker every second. Strong stuff, kid. Don't mess with it. Wow, it's getting thicker every second. Strong stuff, kid. I've got a ladder in my pocket. Bet that will make you barf for sure. Is it from their aloft? They only use naturally fallen branches collected by their birds. See? It's possible to live in harmony with nature, you barbarian. Dang. So what do we need the sap for, then? I, need, I probably need the bucket to get it. Yeah, you need the bucket and whatnot in order to, like, you know... In order to pick up some sap. I bet you they don't even- I bet you, like, the solution to the puzzle is not their fucking, uh... Can you hear me up there? Let's see. Okay, now flip it and stick it. Marshall Dune? Mm hmm? Do you want the stool? How about now? 
Is the construction coming along better? Ah, the sand is falling apart, and so am I. Better let you get back to the feast. Yes, yes. Also, I know These I told you, but I already found yeah, that was uh, themselves. that was Pen Ward. <laughs> yeah. A lot of Cartoon Network alumni in this shit, which is kind of funny. And no, you know who I found out too. What? Guess who? Vel guess who the voice actress of Vela voiced? Oh yeah, you told me. Uh, the fucking that one lady from Star Wars and shit. Yes, the Jedi, the Jedi from one of my childhood games. Fucking Adi Kalia, and I couldn't believe that shit. I was like, what? <laughs> All right, so I, I guess I either need the bucket too to get that. Yeah. Nobody's interested in this fucking stool aside from making the tree barf. And I can't really do much because the snake is addicted to the horn. What do I do? Do we need to get anything from the clouds? I don't think we can go back up to the clouds. No, wait, maybe we can. You must give up something. You must give up something. Yeah, well, there we go. We're climbing back up to the sky. I thought of it. Maybe we need, like, a fruit. Probably. Also, I heard somebody calling. Hello? Oh! That was Jack Black. Yeah. Oh, let me put this on real sec, real quick. Before we fall that off. way to the giant fruit and tree. And fall to our demise. I think we're gonna need, like, a piece of fruit. Maybe. <coughs> Look at him, he's just so happy. The I guess bird. if my town had just one tree, happy. the bird with her egg. Can't reach that She's spot. Really Maybe I could find a low-hanging branch. Can't reach that spot. Maybe I could find a low-hanging branch. Give me some fruit. Dang. Maybe we need the bucket for that too. Yeah. Either that or it fell down to the lower level over here. Oh, the stool disappeared. What? Oh, there we go. Hmm. Firm. Uh -huh. And pungent. Just what I needed. All right, there we go. So that's probably the solution to the fucking ri the riddle. When I grow up, I want to be a tree. Acorn becomes tree. Yes. Acorn tree. Becomes tree. The happiest bird. Burb. The happiest burb. With a big ol' egg. Yeah. You can't just fall down here. I wonder what happened yes, to the Like so. I wonder what. I wonder what happened to Feather. That is a good question. It's just gone. All right, so I bet we're gonna find something in the. Uh... <laughs> I bet we're gonna find something in the frickin' like temple that's gonna be like, yes. This will be the answer to all of our woes. Mm -hmm. We just gotta get over there and whatnot. But yeah, I think- I forgot what else- The funny part was I forgot who- uh, What else, like, uh, Vela's VA voiced in. And I couldn't- um, I couldn't believe it. I know it. she was in Team America. World yeah. Team America. That was one of the things. And one of the Teen Titans movies. I forget what it was called, though. 
it had to be one of like the recent ones too. Yeah. Hey. Here I she got comes you. Again. Hey, hey, here. Got the solution to your riddle. Check it out. Fruit. No thanks. These are our only rows. We don't want to get them all sticky. It's the answer to your riddle. But it's just a fruit. With a pit inside. Oh my god. It's so simple. Why didn't we get that? Oh man. That's been bugging us all day. But what does it have to do with the pyramid? Huh? Oh, nothing. It's just something our friend Becky Yorn told us this morning. <laughs> she thinks she's so smart. I can't wait to rub this thing in her face. So, uh, can I go in there now? Oh, yeah, yeah, whatever. Knock yourself out. Why do we feel like they're faking the blindness? Either that or like... Either that or they're blind. Or they're not blind in like the... Uh, it's that same sense, religious but symbol. So to, like, but this you know, one is recessed, like a socket. In a metaphorical sense, you know what I mean? I wonder what that symbol means. I getcha. Also, guess this is where they bury their God. How much you want to bet too that their freaking God ain't blind neither? Probably not. Let's see. There's symbols. There's that symbol there's, again. There's symbols. There's like things. Guess this is where they buried their old God. Such strange shapes in here. Hmm. Guess this is where they buried their old god. So they put sand down here, there's candles, there's symbols. I think climbing up on their god's tomb would be frowned upon. I don't think he needs a place to sit. Hmm. I'm trying to look for anything of like interest in the background. That symbol is so strange, but familiar. Is that a sea turtle? No. It kinda looks like it. The top of this pyramid is transparent. So strange. I see like a violin or a euchre of some sorts hanging by that mobile. I'm trying to find it. It's the pink one. Oh, so I see. I'm looking at. Oh, it's 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 it looks like it's it though. It's actually just two. It's actually just two rocks and shit. My bad. Three. There's a glow. Yeah, I can see that. They're doing like the. Uh... Well, there's that over there. It's that same religious symbol, but this one is recessed like a socket. So I need to find need a something. thing. Yeah. They're both the secret eye. <sighs> so we need like, We need like another fucking random ass thing that I don't know where it could be. Yeah. We've been to like most of the screens, unless there's more to do over in freaking like Birdland. It might be. Who knows? Hello, Feather. Gotta climb all the way back to fucking like Bird Town. Bird Town. Well, cause Feather is got like my only thing is like Feather is gone. True. I was gonna say what the fuck was that, and I'm like, oh, it's just a bird. Can't, you can't run on a cloud. heard him all right what you got going on well I'll see you two later farewell stick to the paths mm. 
How's it hanging? <laughs> Good one. Well, I'll leave you alone. Just like Mark Chathra did. I'm used to it. So she's still upset about that. Mm -hmm. We can walk off the clouds there, but again, I don't think it's going to do anything. Hi. Hey, welcome back. Can't get up there. The purpose of that is none. Well, I think we already did what we needed to do. Yeah, I don't think we got it. We don't have to come back to Birdland. There's like nothing here of value. Sap. I need like a thing to put in the recess of that one spot. Mm -hmm. It's lost on me because it's just like, what the fuck do we do? Ooh, pretty. Wait. I like how shiny the sun is. What's up? Oh. Oh. Well, you know what? He's not gonna miss it. He doesn't leave his house. True. He's boarded up all the windows anyway. Now I'll know for next time if I ever play this again. That'll be, well, maybe I'll forget. That's kind of, like, that's what I mean, like, I was like, wait a minute. That's a stain, that's a stained glass window. I can interact with that. What the fuck is up with this now? Right. Bella, you can run. There you go. Let's see. I don't think that will fit in this socket. Nah, that doesn't need a new sun. Especially not a vintage crystal one. Vintage crystal, eh? I don't want to desecrate these ancient writings. Those girls outside have sticks. Try the, uh... Try them... Try it's that like same religious symbol. The, uh, I don't think that like, will fit right in this socket. I don't think that's the right shape to go in there. You don't think that's the right shape to go in there? Just change the direction. Just change how you point in it. What are you talking about? I don't want to desecrate these ancient writings. Those girls outside have stick. Such strange shapes in here. Such strange shapes in here. The top of this pyramid is transparent. So strange. Hmm. Oh, go back to the marshal and whatnot. Oh, I see. I like how we you come back out. Have to, you actually have to go ask him something about his fucking hat. Something that looks good on him and shit. But it looks good on you, Marshall. Marshall Dune? Mm -hmm. Hey, about your bucket hat. About your bucket hat? It looks great on you. Very fancy. What? Fancy? But I'm a man of the people. I'm never going to win this election if I come off as haughty and elite. Here, take this away from me. Thank you, child. I'm firing my stylist tomorrow. Uh, Better let you get back to the feast. Ah, uh, yes, there we go. These aren't going to serve up themselves. All right, Baldy. See you later. I got the thing I needed from you. <laughs> Time to get some sap. Get some sap from a poor, poor sap. Hmm, it's already soaking into the ground. I have to catch it with... Say it! What did Curtis do to the old spruce? He... He butchered her! Turn... I'll let you get back to your screaming. He butchered her! Please leave before I vomit, you foul, ruthless stump! Um... Wait till you see the stool that I made again. You can Wait, you have still to the... see the oh, grain of the what... wood. Oh, 
and now you're decorating you me like a Christmas tree? Is there no end to the humiliation? Wait. Christmas is in this world? You can still see the Jesus exists. Of the wood. There so we go. So that means that someone can experience evil on Christmas. Oh my God. <laughs> so now what do I do with this sap? Something. Hey, hey. Do you want some pancakes here, unprocessed? That would be fun, but making them sticky won't solve much. Yeah, well, you can just knock them over. Oh. They'll stick together and just take the thing. Construction and whatnot. Oh, I yeah. think Curtis will miss this. Much. Here, this will make your sand mixture stick together better. Really? It's like cement. How do you know? I'm a baker. I know my ingredients. At this point, I'd try anything. Hey, Clarence, bring that load down here, will you? I hope you're right about this. It's never failed me before. How many times have you used it? Never. Shh. Let's watch. Here comes a wave. I can't look. What'd I tell you? Now that's a sandcastle. Looks like we're in business. All we need to do now is get those maidens in tune. Oh, God. All right, girls, time for the talent portion. Oh, no. Let's I don't want to hear this. Oh, God. Marshall Dune? Mm -hmm. I need to enter the Maiden's Feast. Well, I suppose I do owe you one for your help with construction. Unfortunately, you just don't have the right scent for it, my child. Better let you get back to the feast. Yes, yes. These maidens aren't going to serve up themselves. You can steal it while they're distracted. That's the note, okay? Maybe. Let's do it again. Is this your secret stink for attracting Mom Chathra? Uh, it's my grandmother's traditional cocktail of musk, pheromones, and animal sweat. And I'm not sharing it with anybody. Well, I don't need it anyway. Daddy says I exude it naturally. You know what? I quit. Mom Chathra, take me instead. Two, three, four. Uh, you guys want to see something pretty? That's okay. I already have a mirror. <laughs> <laughs> it's true. Her mirror is really pretty. Oh god. Ooh, what was that? Let's see. Did a whale swim by? Do it so we still have like, like this um Okay. Mm. Ew. I don't want to put this pretty little crystal in there. Remember what I said about the your crystal. diaphragms, girls? And singing from them? Do you want to see something pretty we can't see? Oh. Let's do it again. Um, there, there's actually one thing we can talk to Curtis about. Oh. Well, I went all the way back to the fucking... I went all the way back oh out to God. the cabin. Now you're decorating me like a Christmas tree, so Jesus exists in this universe. Catch you later, Curtis. Beware the trees. I'm his friend Jesus. Hey, the sun part, um, oh. fell out when I walked by. Man, I guess the heavy crystal I used for the sun needs a thicker lead around it. You just put it back up there and I'll fix it later. Thicker lead? That's more, the right? second hole I've put in this cabin so far. I have what? Art. Art. I'll put it back just as soon like as piece, I'm done like with a it. Piece of, like an art piece or some shit like that? I mean, I have this stool. That can count as art. There's also that up there. Yeah, why don't I feel you like I should get to know that guy before I steal his art. Hi. Hey, Bella. Hey, about this art. Yeah? 
What is it? Well, you know. It's abstract. It's kind of a tone poem, really. A tone uh, poem? What? Huh. I find it does some interesting things with the space between viewer and image. Okay. Can I have it? No way, man. That thing's vintage. What the fuck? Aren't you bothered by its elitist themes? Aren't you bothered what? by its elitist themes? I probably would be if I had such a superficial understanding of the work. The flannel, the beard. How do you know it's hanging right side up? Because the dude's little feet go on the bottom, duh. Where'd you get it? I bought it from this slightly shady girl from Shell Mound. Said she was selling it to get money to move out of town. I like how it matches your decor. Decor? I don't have a decor. The purpose of art is not decor, man. Why do you have it up then? I only had it up there ironically, but I was actually getting sick of it. If you like it, just take it. Really? <laughs> okay. Catch you later, Curtis. Beware the trees. I feel like I should get to know him before I take the art. Okay, I'm taking this. Cool. I mean, he let and you I, have a I bunch of other kind of shit. When I was your age, too. Yeah. All right, now we can go back to town and get away with shit. What an abstract piece of art. Like, that was something, too, where I'm like, oh, it's just a decoration. I don't think that's going to be that important. Oh, it is? It is. I mean, look at the shape. If I was a kid, like, if I was a kid playing this, I wouldn't know. I'd just be like, oh, it's just a thing. I'm like, what do I do now? Let's practice. Oh, Mog, shine your light on me. Oh, Mog, shine your light on me. All right, let's see. Put this in here. And what does it do? found my circuit control router. That's awesome. Now I can fire up the ship and get back to Laruna. What? What? Were you really dead? No, I was just preserved in cryogenic suspension for 300 years. I guess all the locals I knew here are long dead. That's kind of a relief. They were a little annoying. Part of the reason I went into Chrysalation to tell you the truth. Are you the dead eye god? Man, that's so embarrassing. The locals called me that when my spaceship crashed here, and I kind of went along with it because, well, you know, God. What? You're welcome. Oh, yeah, uh, thanks for finding my circuit control router. I lost it during the crash and couldn't find it anywhere. So this I is another guy, presumably, like Shay. Saying, give me this, give me this. After a few years, I just had to put myself in cryogenic storage and hope someone smarter would come along and find it. Um... Can I help? Depends. You know anything about spaceships? No. I'm just a baker from sugar bunting. Sugar bunting? Is that anything like steel bunting? When I first landed, there was this town called Steel Bunting that the locals were all afraid of. Apparently, it's full of badasses. Who voice is this guy? He's... <laughs> uh. What's Laruna? That's my home planet. Or at least it was. He sounds familiar. It's even still there. So we're standing in a spaceship? What's all this equipment do? This is the main observation deck of my ship. So this stuff mostly scans for signs of life or habitable worlds. Anything that would help the mission. Uh... So we're standing in a spaceship? Just the upper observation deck. The rest of it's buried underneath. I'm gonna need to fix some more wiring before I can even gain access to it. Does the ship you mentioned so have any weapons? Further inspection and whatnot. Hey, whoa. Yeah. There's a giant monster that's um, destroying villages and eating young fire. girls, and it may or may um, not have already. Uh, My whole family might be. From, uh, anyway, I just need to take down a horrible monster. Will you help? Um, 
Alex I, uh, Vergopolis? I mean, sure. Did he make I, anything, I like, one, notable? But my ship didn't have any weapons that I, I mean, know he was of. I'll dig around once I get this heap working and let you know. And whatnot. So, you know, he... So, you know, he had a hand with, like, rock band and What was your mission? Shit. Well, that Operation makes sense, Dandelion. actually. Varuna was yeah. dying. The spaceship was supposed to give us a fresh chance in a new home. But instead, we crashed here. How'd your ship crash? I hate to think about it, but there's a chance it was me. I tried to hack into the ship's controls and take over. Then some weird stuff happened, and the next thing I know, I'm here. Okay, see you later. Uh-huh. He kind of sounds bored. Hey, you like this Need thing? Need some stained glass for that pretty mobile on the ceiling? Oh, man. Those weirdos really hung up some crazy stuff, didn't they? I'm gonna have to clean house before I take off. Uh. I wonder what... Careful with that device. If it's hooked up wrong, it can be very destructive. So... Hi. Hey. Any luck so far? Well, there are some missing parts. But something if I can get them all, I should be able to get something working. As a weapon? Oh, uh, no, sorry. Get my ship working so I can get out of here, I mean. I haven't started on the whole weapon thing yet. Let me know if you have any ideas. Okay, you see you later. You want a stool? Uh-huh. You know, that Curtis looks like such a slacker. I don't think that's the right shape to go in there. Ooh. Pretty colors. Whoops. Hey, that was my amplifying quartz. Without that, how am I supposed to read the data from the search beam? Sorry. I'll get a new one. Uh, don't bother. All I really care about is getting out of here, and I don't need a search beam for that. Just put the thing back. Just put this in there. Nailed it. What have you done? Uh... Fixed your ship? <laughs> I put the amplifying quartz after the laser coil. If I powered up the beam in this configuration, I mean, the thermal feedback alone could melt down my entire ship. I could conceivably release the extra energy out of the targeting iris, but that would only produce a powerful weaponized... Well, heck, let's just call a death ray a death ray. Yay! Why do they sound so bored, though? <coughs> no, nah, don't shoot a seagull, please. You're so ugly. <laughs> I'm glad I'm blind. <laughs> okay. The targeting iris has 300 years of rust on it, but it should do the trick. I'll try to lure him into a good spot. You can fire the weapon with this remote trigger. Like this? No! Okay, oh, shut it true. down. Clarence, was that you? Knock it off! Just use quick bursts, or that hacked circuit of yours will cause a meltdown up here. I'm not sure how to thank you for this. You know what? The whole time I was on that spaceship, all I really wanted was to be as useful as I feel right now. Well, wish me luck. Well... Hey, if you're really from steel bunting, I'm sure you're well, not gonna need it. He's gonna... Well, all you gotta do is blow up a fucking, like... Hold on. Let me go- Oh, they're back awake. I thought I could be like, let me take their sticks. Right, now I just need to find a way to... Get their perfume. That's not a good use for a Chum at them and shit. You know what I mean? Hmm. This is how I fire the dead eye pyramid beam when the time is right. Looking at this chum trough makes me really happy I grew up in a baking town instead of a fishing town. Let me disintegrate him. All right. Spray him with chum and then I can seal the fragrance. I had like a shovel. Yeah. I need like to get up like that little fucking like trowel they used in Jaws. 
Let's cut this ribbon already. You Maybe tell you're him, up, made it. That The ribbon the is there shirt. for your protection. The arena is still under construction. Maybe you can use that shooter thing and spray it at the, uh... The only thing I'm doing with this button is shooting Mog Chathra in the face. Girls, you need to... The only thing I'm doing with this button is shooting Mog Chathra in the face. Why don't we disintegrate two girls and just, you know... The only thing I'm doing with this button is shooting Mog we'll get, Chathra We'll be a shoo-in for the fucking, like... We'll be the shoo-in for the feast. We just want to go and get eaten. Remember what I said about your diaphragms, girls? And singing from them? Do it just like that. I think we need I think we need to find like another item. Yeah. We can't oh, Why don't you ask why don't you ask the druids if they have like a weapon or some shit? Back at the temple. Do they have a weapon? Yeah. We only have these oh, hitting sticks. Hey, you guys got a weapon on you? But how could we both have had the same exact ring? Uh. Hey, can I get you guys something? Like what? Maybe a refre. Holy tear gas. <laughs> Maybe a refreshing beverage? No thanks. I've got a flask of barnacle juice under this robe. Diet barnacle juice over here. Uh. What is that strange symbol I see all over the pyramid? You mean the Gamethus? That was the sacred symbol of Gamethus. the Dead Eye God. It is said that in his day, the Dead Eye God would draw the Gamethus for all his followers. That was very important to him. And so we worship it to this day. The Gamethus. Hey, did you guys see the Dead Eye God? She must have heard us talking. Look, it was only a shared vision. Perfectly normal among devoted people, especially when they've been standing up all day. The blood goes to your feet. Hey, hey, okay. Hey, can I get you guys something? Maybe the holy tear like gas. What? All right. Some more holy You're the tears. thing. Oh yeah. yeah. Here. Just fill that up for me if you could. Thanks. Bye. <laughs> Sense you later. Sense me. I forgot that they had that little thing too. All right, you guys gonna experience carry. Come to me, old chum. I mean, when is this not going to come in handy? Oh, this is gonna be fucking disgusting. This is gonna be so rancid. It's bloody too. Oh. <laughs> Drusilla, don't you think I can smell that? Okay, this time it really wasn't me. Is this about the feathers we took for our costumes? We can have them back! <laughs> hey, maybe this perfume is what's attracting them. I'll get rid of it. Great owl! Great idea! What about I'm surprised me? none of those owl. birds are getting hooked I on those headpieces. She has to save whom she can't. How? I'll tell Mog Chathra about you, Drusilla. My dad is gonna have to Oh, man. <coughs> the things monsters go for these days. Not worth it. Let's get over to the guy. Marshal Dune? Mm -hmm. Put me in the maiden's I need feast. to enter the maiden's feast. Well, I suppose I do owe you one for your help with construction. Oh, my, oh, my. Now that is how you attract a monster. You are in, my girl. My compliments to your grandmother. This is not a... Truly monstrous. Oh, yeah, was a Shantae swimsuit thing. What's up? 
Ladies and gentlemen, it's showtime! Yeah, like a little collection of swords. You know what to do, girls. Oh, Fucking thing out. This way, follow me. All right, get ready to fire that thing. Go. with one arm tied behind my back, but not two. Take the shot. Oh, Get geez. ready to fire that thing. Do it. It's oh, right in the eye. Get that laser ready. Oh, shit. My hands are stuck. Oh, no. I can't reach. This whole mountain is gonna melt down. Right. Uh oh. Not again. We get it. It's not the time yet to get eaten. Even his eyes are armor plated. He must have a more vulnerable spot. The mouth. Come on, you stupid death ray. Follow me, Mom. The mouth? He's got both my arms tied up. The eyes are armored. Wait, Karen. I think I'm What's up? Thick hide. Get ready. You can probably use, a, use uh, one of your um, items along with the uh, thing and shit. Better? I'd shove it in his other yeah. mouth, but I can't reach it from here. Oh, yeah! Wait! When he grabs and whatnot. Yeah. If I could just get one of my arms free, I can't fire away. Oh shit. Dang, this timing is tough. I'd love to throw my stool at him, but I doubt it would hurt. So we much. gotta get like the arms free and whatnot. I think when she like kicks up and whatnot, that's your time and shit, you know what I mean? My hands are stuck. All right. No, I need to find a more vulnerable spot. It's gotta be the mouth. Or oh, wait. I can't reach. You He's got both my arms first. tied up. Now. Ah. Just a slap on the wrist. Good call, actually. Take the shot. Oh, damn, missed. Hurry up and recharge already. Fire away. Here we got one more. Ooh. Sounds like that hurt. Oh, it dodged. Now. Ah, here we go. We got a free arm. Surprise you! Ha! Whoa! Go Get right for the mouth! Get that laser ready! Die, you monster! There we go. We're gonna have a meltdown up here. That was easy and tricky at the same time when you figure out what you gotta do. Oh God! She's KO'd.
and inside. Fuck. Now he wants to go back in. Please don't tell anyone. Oh god, who do we... Who do we choose now? I think either way, it's still like... it's. I think it's still like the same as the... Uh... I know it's gonna like it's gonna stop and then we get to yeah you know i wonder what vela's whole like thing inside of this ship is gonna be actually oh hey the knife came back trying to stab me why don't take it personally kid it's just what i do for instance just a minute ago, I took down this whole ship after ripping the very fabric of space itself. There we go. You got off easy. Just when I thought things couldn't get any stranger. All right, you. Um. I know you'd be back. Something tells me you're a girl who knows the value of a good knife. Just take it. Just confirm that you're tough. Can I just confirm that you were a talking Can knife? Can I just confirm that you are a talking knife? <laughs> Because I'm trying to figure out if I'm losing my mind, or just mildly hallucinating. Oh, I'm the real deal, kid. A technological marvel. And sharp, too. With. What are you doing inside the monster, Mog Chathra? Monster? Kid, you are inside the spaceship Bossa Nostra. Or, uh, just outside of it, actually. The Bossa Nostra. We're outside the of the spaceship? Nostra. Then how can I breathe? Well, I learned that the Don't last time. But... I'm solid state. This is a name I still I can't get admit, over. Though, this ship and everything around it has been acting a little nutty since I cut it. But that's to be expected. We need you. Who's the captain of this ship? Well, the other kid who just tumbled through that bright spot in space, that's the one we call the commander. But the real brains of the operation, we just call mom. <laughs> Where can I find mom? Beats me. I haven't heard from her in a while. Why can't I take the knife? Hey, I didn't stab her. Can't be that on me. You're coming. You're coming with me. And for the record, I took down this ship. Whatever. Ride's a ride. <laughs> now we have a weapon. I can still see the sky through that hole in space. For that hole in space. Attention, current altitude below recommended I level. Think... Outer hull breach detected. I think like Attempting the emergency takeoff. I think like the only not great thing about this is the voice direction's a little weird. Hmm. Oh, let me guess. They're already cut. Well, I can take some tubing They're with me. They're already cut. Yeah. They're already cut. You never know when it'll come in handy. All right, fine. Mm -hmm. <laughs> fine. I Warning. won't take this. Ship off axis. Gyro stabilizers offline. I'm surprised we're not taking off water. Anti-gravity field unavailable during hull breach. Open up. Dang, not opening. 
Initializing Starfield Prepare. Oh. Function. What is that? A goldfish bowl? Oh. I guess space helmet makes more oh. sense. Matrix clear. Completing Starfield Repair. If it works, it works. Starfield Integrity Restored. Initializing refresherization. Uh-oh. Uh-oh! I don't need to wear a helmet. There's plenty of air here. Unable to repressurize. Unable to engage anti-gravity field. Ah, I see we gotta fix air the... Air transport system incomplete. Unable to repressurize. Hey, Pointy, you actually any good at cutting stuff? That ain't Dutch. Any answers? Dutch. Yes. I like that. Yes, yes, yes. Finally. Thanks for that. Thank you. I think this is the beginning of a beautiful friendship. Enjoy it while it lasts. Hmm. I might be able to make a connection with this little hose, but which one? That goes there. Accessing maintenance panel 36. Huh. To here. Why not? Warning. Coolant detected in air supply. That doesn't sound good. <laughs> Warning. Coolant detected in air supply. Hmm. I might be able to make a connection. Warning. Air venting into sewage overflow. Yeah. Oh God. Ugh. Weird smell coming out of this one. Accessing maintenance panel one one four. At least nothing blew up. I like how it's I like how it's padded with like soft goods. Yeah. I can't reach that platform. Can I cut another, like... I don't need to clean under my fingernails right now. Yeah! I, I, I didn't... What, what are you talking about? Cut the... Cut more rope. There's a weak point on that hose, but I can't reach it from here. Oh, I see. Now we're gonna fucking fall to our... I could get a longer hose by cutting it up here, but... Then I don't think I'd survive the fall. Come on, I bet 50% of us would survive. Maybe... Oh! Maybe if we... The other panel, maybe, right? Yeah. But which one? Let's hook this part. Accessing maintenance panel 36. Hmm... Nice and soft. There we go. A good knife is handy to have around. There's a weak point on that hose. If we land on that, right, if we fall, we should be good in be theory. And, yeah. Well, who wants to live forever, right? I'm really starting to like you, kid. That hurt, she but it falls was worth snaps it for this pose. I think. <laughs> Cutting is always worth it. Cutting is Air always transport system incomplete. Unable to repressurize. Hopefully I can make some new... This one could be important. Or not. Okay. Should do something good. Warning, unanticipated hydraulic connection. Well, now what? Air transport system integrity restored. Oh, yeah. Beginning repressurization. Wait, that's good, right? Engaging anti gravity field. Oh, here there we, we go. go. Gyro stabilizers <laughs> online. Is the room spinning, or is it me? What's with like 
the voice direction. It's a little awkward. Hey, there's the hat. Uh-oh. Aw, oh, I missed it. She sounds so bored. Yikes. What's that claw thing? And that claw thing. Oh, no. I wonder if that little claw is getting as dizzy as I am. I know you want... Wow. Oh. You got me. Now let go of that helmet. There, now we use... Dang. That timing. Come on. Hand-to-hand -hand combat. Hmm. Not even a handshake. They just don't seem to be attracted to each other. Well, how about we use this to grab... Well, what good are you, Arm, if you can't reach stuff? And I like how it just shrinks into like a little pocket. I think that would just shatter it. Let's see. The only thing this trigger is good for is firing Alex's death ray. And this boot looks a little closer than the other one. Let me see if I can... No. <laughs> She's just running in... <laughs> She's just running through and sounding bored. Oh, it's too far away. Whoops. Facing the wrong way. Oh, I see. Oh, stupid giant claw. Get out of the way. Well, there's some more emotion. All right, hold on. All right, spin. Come on. Go. Get it. Gotcha. Hmm. Something tells me I'm not going to be able to get you to let go of that boot, am I? Rats. I need to get the timing right. Oh, maybe I can use the. It's a mag boot, so maybe I can use it to get the other one. Yeah. Oh. Still uh. not long enough. Or maybe you gotta wait. Whoa! Oh. I recognize that grip. I'll bet you were inside one of those tentacles that grabbed me on the beach. Ah, uh, I see. Probably one of the ones I shot, I'm guessing. Well, serves you right. So it's a boom arm, huh? Yeah. Can't reach that boot. Probably not. I don't want to fly out that way. Let's cut it off. I don't need to clean under my fingernails right now. Good. I don't want to fly out that way. I don't need to wear a helmet. There's plenty of air here. So... I can't reach that boot. Probably not my size anyway. Maybe I can push off this thing. Woohoo! Space! I did it! Oh, come on. Oh, that's better. The air was starting to get a little thin out there. Well, how fucked up is the inside of this ship now, I wonder? I'm either in some sort of hallway, or else it's the creature's esophagus. Girl, it's a ship. You literally just got explained everything. Oh, no. We're moving. That means... Are you another prisoner of Mog Chathra? Must be a maiden from some land of hexagons. <laughs> Don't worry, little hexagal. I'm gonna find all the other maidens and get us all out of here, okay? <laughs> Leading us to the evacuation point. Warning. Objects placed into this trash chute will be jettisoned from the ship. Hmm. Even though the helmet is the perfect size and shape for that opening, I'm going to hold on to it for a while. Let's see. Is that a train? Hmm. This door doesn't open. We can't even get through any of the old do Oh, hey, there we go. Man, this place is a mess. Where will we get through Mal that Chathra one? may be alive again, but he doesn't look so hot. Looks like something horrible is in here. 
But what? Uh, door won't open. Uh. Hey, can you press on that thing? The hexagon. Hey, Usani. Hey, Usani. No way am I touching that. I'd get electrocuted. The ship is crying. Oh, thank you for the uh, hydration. Hold on. Wait a second. Let me go see that one spot. Maybe we gotta like cut through the wires. So much junk in here. Oh, oh no, there we go. Oh. This must be the room where they oh, melt stuff. Oh, must be locked or something. We can't go to Ice Cream Mountain. We can't go anywhere. How are you doing, Usani? Oh, here we go. Ah, the belly of the beast. Or ship. Either way, monster or machine, I took it down before. Should be even easier from the inside. How do you know that, Bella? Is this the brain? Who knows? Looks important, but also super fake. Must be a decoy. So I wonder what happens if we go to the teleportation hub. Not opening. That's a good question. No, we can't go to the teleportation hub. Ah. Someone ought to fix that. Locked, maybe. If I could find the brains of this operation, I could open all these doors. We're just speeding away. Mm -hmm. Is that the bedroom? Wait. Yeah, I think this was the bedroom. Oh, there it is. What's this? Some sort of living quarters? Oh, quit with the sad stuff, Magchatra. You brought this on yourself. Gruesome. Oh, God. Is that real? Oh, yeah. That looks pretty heavy. Imagine if he was in the bed when that happened. Ooh. Huh. Someone pried open that this bed. That would not be a pretty sight. I wonder sight. why. Guess there's only one way to find out. Oh, no. We're going to find the dude. Shay. You. It's you. The last one. What the fuck? Who are you? Oh, hey, look, Mary, are it's you, you in control of this monster ship? It's not no. me. She is in control. Just... The brains. I was just a stowaway sent to save the young boy. What were you saving the boy from? From her. The one they call Mom. She's been programmed to keep the boy safe. But she's taken it beyond sanity or reason. Now he is her prisoner. We all are. What? Who's her? I mean, who is she? She's the brains of this ship. You can find her in the room next to the galley. But be careful. She has eyes and hands everywhere. Well, we had we kinda had one. The boy's not a prisoner anymore. He escaped when I uh boarded. I see. Well, that shouldn't affect the mission. Which mission? To get control of this ship and end this madness. Is the boy the one kidnapping maidens? No. And, yes, he made the selections but didn't know what he was selecting. He thought he was rescuing helpless creatures because that's really what we were doing. How were what you the rescuing fuck? anyone? We were saving you <coughs> from the plague. What plague? Get me out of here and I'll explain. I think he's fucking lying. Why did you have the boy select whom you were rescuing? Even our best technology is no match for the instincts of a boy like Shay. Especially Cause it, his now age. all of a sudden You're he's talking really about a plague. Anything. It's hard for me to talk get this off of me and i can explain <laughs> he's changing the story between the two people why did you call me the last one 
you were the last creature, uh, final subject of our rescue mission. She seemed especially interested in you on more than one occasion. Why did you single me out? I assume he sensed your strength somehow, your spirit. I hope he was right. What the fuck? Where are the other maidens you rescued? They're safe, but locked up. Once we get control of the ship back from her, we can free them. Where is this ship headed? I assume back to its homeland to deliver us to its masters. <laughs> he keeps yes. changing the story. But only if we can get into the central control room. She's locked the door with some sort of I was manual trying to protect override. you from the plague. It can only be opened but by the ship her is going back to its inside. masters. Can you open any of the locked doors on the ship? Well, my arms are pinned, but I think I can push this one button. That's the best I can do. Thanks. I can work with that. The Star Weaver. Hey, wait, you're a wolf. Sorry, I've had a really strange day, and it's getting hard to recognize strange things right away. It's a long story, but I promise if you help me get out of here, I'll explain everything. I've got to go. Get into the central control room. It's the only way to stop this. Right, last time we killed fucking Richard Steven Horvitz. Looks like some sort of animal yeah. sleeps here. Hmm. This door is locked. So I that one is. What they... Ah, right. It's like a museum in here. After a tornado. Wonder if I can learn something about that kid in here. Considering everything, yes. It's a painting of what looks like a red boot. Looks like a note written by a little kid. Dear Shoe Fairy, thanks for the shoes. Aw, the red striped ones were cool, and so oh, were the green shoe. ones with skulls. But next year, could I please have red shoes with skulls? Please, please, please. Thanks, Shay. Sheesh, demanding. Shay's first space boots, age five. That train wreck looks like ominous foreshadowing to me. That is the happiest snake attack victim I've ever seen. What the fuck? What the fuck? I'll give this guy one excuse. He had a weird childhood. So why'd they take away that simulation? That would be more- Well, aside- Well, the train crash was actually interesting. But it's more interesting than Ice Cream Town. I wonder if he lost his first teeth by licking a moving beater, like I did. Decid deciduous incisor. That reminds me- you know, I was thinking about it. We, what a sad sack. I was thinking about like the conversation we had a while back about like going to the dentist. It says safety award, footwear category. Footwear category. Looks like some sort of medical report. Metabot exam report. Patient continues normal, healthy development. Unlike his first five years, this year has been marked by a remarkable growth spurt. In one year, he has grown two inches taller and gained three shoe sizes. Splarg therapy appears to be working. Splarg? What? Shea Volta, best actor, Purple Boots, the musical. What's the deal with, what's the deal with boots and shoes and, uh? Splark therapy. I wonder if he lost his first teeth by licking a moving beater, like I did. Hey, uh, wake up. Hello? Hey, who are you? My name's Bella. What's yours? Mine? Well, mine is, uh... Gosh, it's been so long since anyone asked. Let me look it up. Summer. 
It's Melanie. Huh. Are you a closet, Melanie? Kind of. Step inside. I'll show you. Oh no, is the head gonna shrink again? Good. Now close those eyes tight. And make sure your eyeballs make it to the same place you do. What? Fingers crossed. <laughs> Surprise! I'm a teleporter. Now you tell me a secret. Hey, where'd the other room go? What's wrong with my head? And my voice? Oh, no, I thought I had that fixed. You made my head bigger. No worries, sweetie. What? It's temporary. Take a trip back sure. through me and I'll set things right. This is weird. I don't think this helmet would do much good there. Huh. Okay, so now the teleporter room's unlocked too. Yep. Hello? You know, she hasn't said much no since the ship was attacked. Hope she's okay. She's just being a drama queen, so she needs special maintenance. Give it up, Nadine! What room is what room did that one go to? Oh that's the that's Hi. the core, right. Who wants to go to the starboard passageway. It's so nice to de-risk your people. Miss you already. Ah. Oh, there's my old head again. Are you sure? It still looks a little big to me. Yes. This is all brains. All right, all right. Okay, so the one going through once is what increases the head size. Yep. Hmm. This door doesn't open. So we need to figure out what we need a bigger head for. Yeah, better put this back to cover my tracks. Why? Walk on through. Just walk on through, man. Okay, so that's open. I guess this is locked because it's that shining red. If I could find the brains yeah. of Let's check the galley. Locked. Mm. Well, I always did want to get out and see some more of the world. No, we're just zooming through it at a super fast speed. Can't take any of that. Let's go back down. So we don't have, we still don't have like a lot of places to like travel to. Looks like some sort of video game. Huh. Tell me about it. That's the switch he used to unlock that door over there. Better leave it unlocked. Oh, we can't get through to the thing to the Star Weaver right now, too. I've got to go. Right. Get into the central control room. So... There was another door, right? Looks like some sort of animal. Hmm. This door is locked. Yeah. I wonder what they keep in here. Unless that was like the star core thing. So let's see, maybe. Again, we'll go through here. Safety award. Aquatics category. Aquatic safety. Hey, Mel. Hey, Mel. Here goes nothing. Bye bye You made my head bigger. No worry, sweetie. It's temporary. Again, what? 
What is this thing? Well, all right, so what do we need a giant head for? It's not for the helmet. No, I don't think so. The computer glitch. Seriously, who do they think they're fooling with this baby stuff? So the ship is still in like extreme disrepair. Wait. Think you can pry this door open, Dutch? Sorry. Once they're locked, only mom can open them. She's the brain of the operation. The brain, eh? Can you take me to her? I tell you this, you're getting warmer. Ah, she's hiding out in the kitchen. She might be. Oh hey! Hello um, in there. Who's out there? I can barely hear you. Huh. My name is Bella Tartine, yeah. and I'm here to take you down. D did you say Martine? Shay, is that you making a joke? What? Engineering department. Just a routine maintenance visit. Engineering department? What are you talking about? Is that you, Shay? It's me, Shay. Oh, really? Is that really you, Shay? You sound so strange. I'm. I was injured. I was injured. It's affecting my voice. Oh, that sounds terrible. If if it's true, oh, I just don't know what to believe. What? If you don't believe I'm Shay, I'm leaving. It's me. Don't you recognize me? Well, not really, to tell you the truth. Okay, I'm not really Shay. What? Are you playing some kind of cruel joke on me? If you don't believe I'm Shay, I'm leaving. Oh, I just don't know what to believe right now. My son would understand that. Maybe. She probably can't, like... See properly. Hello in there. Properly. Who's out there? We probably I have can to barely hear you. In order to make it look like we are Shay and whatnot, you know what I mean? Ship's on fire. You gotta get me. Out. You gotta get out of there. The ship's on fire. You have to get out of there. I know the ship's on fire. That's why I'm staying put in this fireproof room until I figure out what to do. Who is this? Uh. Do I sound more, Do I like, sound more like Shay? Shay? I mean, uh, myself now? Maybe, but I... You sound so strange. If you don't believe I'm Shay, I'm leaving. Oh, I just don't know what to believe right now. My son would understand to, that. Maybe you have to increase your head maybe. to, like, another size or some shit. That would be a... That would be a good move. The only problem is... It seems when I it seems when I hit the teleport though. Maybe it shrinks the head. Do. It shrinks the head back Hi. down. Who wants to go to the starboard passageway? Because remember I went through here. You haven't eaten in at least an hour, have you? Ah, there's my old head again. Hey there. Back to the Nexus? Do I sound like Shay now? It's so nice to de risk new people. You probably have to go through the uh, other teleporter, too. Shay! You made my head bigger. No worry, sweetie, it's temporary. Well, we gotta make her try to sound like Elijah Hi, Wood. Mel. Back to the junk room. Yeah. Fingers crossed. Ah, there's my old head again. So every time... I don't need to wear a helmet. There's plenty of air here. Hey, Mel. Hey, Mel. Fingers crossed. All there? Great. You made my head bigger. Don't worry, sweetie. It's temporary. Hmm. Maybe it's already big enough as it is, so we just have to get I don't think this helmet would do much good there. 
I gotta do something to convince her to get out of that room. Yeah. The ship's on fire. Wait, maybe. Hold on. Hello in there. Maybe you have to go back Who's to the control room without. I can barely. Take the teleport. All clear. It's safe to come out now. Safe? Who are you kidding? I'll be right back. What? Who are you? Let's, uh... I don't think this helmet would do much good there. I don't want to cut that. Only because you haven't tried. Oh yeah, right. What's his face could have a uh a thing or whatever. Hmm. Fucking the guy who stole my name. Hey buddy. I've gotta go. Get into the central control room. It's the only way to stop this. Hmm. So he's got nothing. Let's go get let's go. Let's try charisma another time. Yeah. There's probably something we gotta say that gets her to open the fucking door. Who's out there? I can barely hear you. Just tell the truth. Is this Mog Chathra's brain? Log off the train? I've lost all contact with the train. What? Can you open this door? I could, but I won't. Not until I know who you are. I'll be right back. What? Who are you? Okay. Not until I know who you are. I'm surprised we couldn't take anything from the trophy room. Maybe we have to go back down to like the um Looks like some sort of video game. Maybe we have to go back around to the children's I've gotta uh, go. room. Get into the central use the teleporter so we can like, you know. You get where I'm coming from and shit? Yeah. Hey Mel. Hey Mel. You haven't eaten in at least an hour, have you? Please count fingers and toes before leaving teleporter. Now it's even bigger. Don't push it, honey. Come back through me before you pop. Maybe that'll work. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, so going through the other door also fixes the helmet. Well, also fixes the head, too, so. Yeah. You made my head bigger. Hello in there. Who's out there? I can barely hear you. It's me, Shay. You sound kind of funny. It must be the intercom. But still, I need a little more proof, Shay. I mean, whoever you are. I want to believe it's you, Shay, but everything is just so strange right now. First the crash, and then my controls went dead, and now I can't reach your father. I just... I don't know who to trust. So just make me feel better by answering a few easy questions, okay? Um, oh, we got this. Sure. All right. First question. What was the name of your favorite stuffed animal as a child? What the fuck? Captain? Kissy! Oh, Is that your answer? Yes. Captain? Right, Mr. Huggy. It's me, Shane. Ask me a personal question and I'll prove it to you. All right. yeah. First question. What was the name of your favorite stuffed animal as a child? Mr. Go on. Huggy. Is that your answer? Yes. Mr. Huggy, I see. Oh, Shay, I'm so glad you remembered Mr. Huggy. He was the first friend I ever knit for you. I'm starting to feel kind of bad about this. What was that? Nothing. I see. Well, I have another question for you. Of all my little pet names for you, which one was your favorite? Don't make me do this. Please. 
please, can we not do this? Please, can we not do this? That's, that's exactly what you used to say all the time. You hated my nicknames. I mean, Shay did. Now, just one more question for safety. Damn. I used to make my son new space boots every year until his ninth birthday when he insisted on machine-made boots from the replicator. As he would surely remember, I tried to keep things fresh by never repeating a color or a pattern. So, please tell me what was the color, size, and pattern of his very first space boots. I believe they were purple. Mm -hmm. Purple. And the size? Uh oh, shh. Size four. And the pattern? Polka dots. Polka dots. Shay, it is you. What? <gasps> what? You're not a computer. What? You're not Shay. What have you done to our ship? Where's my son? She's not a computer? What? I don't know. I'm, I'm, uh, huh? Then why didn't she oh. just go? Huh? Uh, uh, okay. Uh. Who are you? And why have you been kidnapping girls with this ship? Are you insane? Uh... Where is the big mom computer that controls this ship? Mom computer? What, what are you talking about? The, the... My name is Bella Tartine. I shot down your ship. What? Why? We are an unarmed deep space vessel on a peaceful mission. <laughs> what? The wolf told me about you. Okay, now just calm down. You, you need some help. You are not in space. Ooh, I'm, I'm still like confused. Window. Well, not anymore. Sir. You shot us down. No, you were never in space. It's all fake. The stars are on the inside. On the outside, you're a monster. But she's right, my friend. There he is. That's the wolf I was talking about. That voice. Hey, why aren't you trapped under that junk anymore? I am no wolf, am I, Hope? I'm an old friend. What the fuck? Marikai, what are you doing what here? Wait, what the hell? I'm here to finish operation. I knew he wasn't a wolf. They looked fake as fuck, but I'm Jesus. Sorry that we had to keep some aspects of the mission secret from you and your family. How are you... You said our world was dying. It was, but then you went forth and found our salvation. Who's he got a There's fucking so marker have. coming out of his head? The logs. Sorry about the outer space theatrics. Just a precaution to save you from the temptation to go native as some of your predecessors did. We were never in space? <laughs> no. Laruna is a great empire unto itself, but is part of this very same planet. Beyond the Plague Dam. Funny you should mention that, Bella. Because here we are. Oh. Oh. Now, while I prepare the ship for sterilization, you two sit tight and relax, and know that you are contributing to the well-being of many generations to come. Up here! I'm a weapon! What? Hey, look! A fork! I'd have a full set if I could just find the- Oh, I wouldn't bring up the S-P-O-O-N if I were you. <gasps> Tiny here broke his heart, so he volunteered for a suicide mission. You shut your mouth, Dutch! What hey, the fuck? Worry. I won't tell him who you dumped it for. <sighs> Yikes. And the 
And the spoon, the, the fork, the fork has a familiar voice too. Hey there, Hope, I'm Bella, sure that's was like it? Nick in, but I know he's been a lot of like those like old school Lucas Art games and all that sort of shit. You know what I mean? The fork has a. Well, she's got a. Uh. So, oh, I'm, I'm getting the feeling the that you weren't behind all these kidnappings. What kidnappings? This ship. On the outside, it's built to look like a monster. <gasps> Every 14 years, a ship like yours comes to a village like mine, and we offer sacrificial maidens to it so it won't destroy the town. It can't be. And then the monster. What is the, the dad's head look huge to? Some of the maidens away forever. This all sounds so crazy, but it sounds exactly like the kind of scheme the thrush would come up with. What? Sorry, I lied about being your son. Okay. The wolf said, "Well, ain't that like a plant?" I'm just sorry, it's okay. I don't blame you. Sounds like Marikai has been fooling all of us Marikai. for a long time. Marikai. is a fucker. How can we get out of here? I locked the door manually before, but now I imagine Marikai's locked it himself. Our only hope is if there are systems he's overlooked. I'm going to find a way out of here. Okay, I'm gonna try to think of a way too. So... This door won't open. Narakai intends for us to stay put, it seems. It looks as though we're still outside, unless we travel through the plague dam. Yeah. Also, the hole's in the hull, right? Door won't open. She's not like Narakai intends for us to stay put. I'm surprised she didn't figure that out that she wasn't in space just by that alone. The only thing this trigger is good for is firing Alex's death ray. And only when we're in range and I have a there's nothing in there to eat. Better not. It might upset her to see her son's what's this? Oh, that's just my central control sphere. I used it to keep a watch on the ship. Changes here and there. Mind if I try it? Sure, but I'm sure Marikai shut down most of the remote features by now. Oh, so she. Huh. Hey, I can see the outside of our door. Looks like the controls have been sabotaged. Really? Oh, if I could just get out there, I'll bet I could fix them. Well, yeah, but if we could get out there, we wouldn't need- Yeah, yeah, I know. But still. So the whole time- Oh! I guess that sparking panel had its power shut off for a reason. Whoops. So the whole time- Ooh, She could've, like- lock and unlock doors. Yeah, like some- Hey, I can see other rooms. Yeah, but probably only the ones Marikai doesn't care about. Hey, cheer up. That's better. The, the annoying part about this is just that it's like, so she could have come out any time, right? And like... Let's see what's going on in here. She wow, could have like, those arms are gone out any time to be like... Yes. Pick that up. Thank you. I am your mother. Wow. You know, like, we, we don't have Wait, to like, you know... what are you know, doing? Central oh, computer. I guess this. It was dirty, but I didn't really need you to. Hey, where are you there going with that? Those things are the mind of. Hey, cheer up! Everything's going to be. Sorry. So that's fucked up. At least we got like access here. Hmm. We can see. This unlocked. Okay, so the Star Weaver's un but the Star Weaver's been unlocked. That's probably all like damaged. Worth a shot. Maybe. I like how this thing whole I like how that thing still functions, the big screen and whatnot. Empty. Unlocked. Here you go. Cheer up. That's the spirit. That's some bad wiring there. 
I never thought my chakra would be so full of smiles. Worth a shot. Uh-oh. Made it pretty dark over there. Huh. How does this thing work? Oh, we need to, like, get a charge. Yeah. Hey, I think we need a safety light over here. Let's turn this on. Someone should unlock. Oh, this is like a... That's my gal. That's the spirit. Uh-oh. Made it pretty dark over there. This is gonna be like a big puzzle, ain't it? Oh Nothing god. In here except a hexagal. Unlocked. Turn that frown upside down. Well, I made all the shot. I made all the things happy. Uh oh. Made it pretty dark over there. Okay, so the power went out. Yeah. So going through that. This door won't open. Maybe we can. Nerikai intends. Maybe we can remove power to the door. Maybe, maybe. Right. Like, is that panel's destroyed? See. <laughs> If we can, like, override something. Yeah. Because the biggest access we got is that hallway. We've unlocked, like, central control in that kitchen, too. Someone should really fix that. That's on like a To think what I'm trying to think what like that wasn't right or was it hey why can't I unlock this thing must be a different system or something what a rip combo any ideas yet no sorry right how can we get out of here? I locked the door manually before, but now I imagine Marikai's locked it himself. Our only hope is if there are systems he's overlooked. I'm going to find a way out of here. Okay, I'm gonna try to think of a way too. That actually might be the case. Yeah. Systems he's overlooked, which has gotta be all those things we can interact with. Making little hexagons happy and all that crap. Is there anything else we can interact in here? So when we leave, the door shuts down. That's some bad wiring there. Someone should really fix that. Let's turn this on. Oh, 
Oh, they brought the... They brought the... <laughs> oh, maybe I can move it. We'd have to probably, like, you know... The body. Or whatever the fu- the, the stu- you know, like, the stuffed human or whatever the fuck. Cause we opened up- we- we got it through that part. We got out of the room. Let's turn this on. I'm trying to hey, get it to like. I think we need a safety light over here. Hey, anyone who's got a flashlight? Ooh, sparky. Oops. <laughs> Turn this room dark for whatever reason. Yeah. I have a feeling we're gonna have to like try to stop them. Hey, why can't I unlock this thing? It must be a different system or something. What a rip. So the airlock door is locked. At least now it is. The emergency robot. Yeah. That was the one that was where the airlock was. Yeah. Maybe we have to guide that and whatnot. Surprised we can't get control of the little robot. Well, maybe if we shut off the lights and whatnot, you know what I mean? Someone should really fix that. Oops, look at her go. Fixing problems just as quickly as. Oh! As I cause them. Hey, I think we need a safety light over here. There she goes. Come on. She. Oh, I see. That wasn't right. Or. Okay, that should take a little while for her to fix. This way. She's in the other room now. Uh oh. Oh. Made it pretty. Oh, wow. Hey, anyone got a flashlight? Good girl. That wasn't good. Uh oh, made it pretty dark over there. That's a bad wiring. Hey, anyone got a flashlight? Oh, I get it. Yeah, she's got to lead people around and whatnot. Wait, she's on it. Yeah. A smile makes everything seem better, don't you think? Hey, I think we need a safety light over here. Uh oh, made it pretty dark over there. Okay. Good girl. Just a little bit more. She'll have 
that fixed in no time. Over here. There we go. Yeah. That's some bad wiring there. The helper unit. Look at it go. Fixing problems just as quickly as the helper unit. Well, as I pause them, worth a shot. <laughs> okay, she's on it. Worth a shot. Wonder what this does. There we oh, go. Bad wiring there. Come on. Don't fix that too quickly now. This way. Ha <laughs> ha. Good girl. Go through the door, you see there's here. accidents going on. You're gonna get us out of the frickin' <laughs> Yes! We he wouldn't made it. he Home wouldn't need stretch. he wouldn't need control of this robot. Right. That's some bullshit. <laughs> what the fuck? Emma. Did it go all the way back? Imagine she, imagine it just walks through that freaking the airlock. Yeah. Maybe it's in the kitchen. Oh, that's a good... You know, you're not wrong. Oh, hey! There you are. Uh, I'm uh, so happy to see you. You hang in there, girl. She senses problem. Kind of like flickering around there and whatnot. Oh! Is that oh, yeah, no, I, 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 Hexagon, oh, like she doesn't need to keep like escorting. You just gotta fix the doors. I know. Okay, let's be careful this time. Okay, that should take a little while for her to fix. Hey, look. There you go. An electrical problem to fix. That's great. Better get on that. That's my girl. Okay, that was a really cool puzzle. Check it out, Hope. You did it! We're free! Attention, approaching red hangar. Prepare for sterilization. Oh no! What the fuck? Wait, 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 wait a sec. So Shay's parents came from here? Why does everything look so fucked up? What is 
this place. This is where they build and store ships like ours. The Mog Factory? I'm afraid so. No. This is great. Instead of killing one Mog, we can destroy all the Mogs forever. Oh, and all the people in the factory, too. Darn. There are no people in the factory. It's all automated, but I really... Great! Now we just have to figure out how not... to use that death ray. Death ray? Yeah, you're right. A death ray isn't going to cut it this time. We're gonna need something bigger. Like a bomb. The only thing I've ever blown up was my family's oven. But with all the high-tech stuff on this ship, there must be something we can make a massive explosion with, right? Maybe, but I... So, I'll make a bomb. Figure out a way to dump it in the factory. And also a way for you and me to get the heck out of here and back to our families. Sound good? Not really. But if there's a chance it will get me back to my family, then it's the only option I've got. Not exactly a battle cry, but I'll take it. We'll make a bomb. I think, that, bomb. I think that. I think that. Should I've written that down? Build a bomb, get it off the ship, and drive the ship out of here. No, I got it. I think that's a little bit easier said than done. Hey, do you know anything about how to build a bomb? Any ideas yet? No. Sorry. Your son is fine, by the way. He jumped off the ship when I got on. He's probably relaxing on the beach, enjoying the sun. Well, that's something at least. And my husband. I didn't see anyone else, but maybe they're together. I hope so. I just wish I could fly back and get them. Well, let's just make sure that's part of our escape. The central computer. Listen, we have to stick together. Let's put the past behind us and team up to stop this horrible business. You want to team up with the captain of the ship that's been terrorizing your homeland? Yes, if you're willing to team up with a girl you just met, who already lied to me once. Yes. On accident. Deal. Can't stop us now. Want to hear how the plan is coming along? Okay. I still need to make a bomb, and... But how do you know how to... I still need to find a way to get it off the ship, and... I still haven't figured out a way to drive like the ship out power of power source So of some I've kind. got a lot of work to do. As long as oh, you the have a core! Plan. Remember, it's like, if not treated properly, it explodes? Right, yeah. There you are. And so nice and clean, too. What about the core? Could be good. Terrorism. I think I found your bedroom, Dutch. <laughs> Where the magic happens. Between you and this spoon here? No. That guy, me and him had a big beef over at Dane. Who won? Don't see him around anymore, do you? Damn. see him around anymore, do ya? Parents ain't spending time. There's still something kind of like fucked up about this whole situation. Yeah. Hey, Richard, you awake? Hi there. You. Ah! You. You. Excuse me? Initialize it. Hello. And thank you for considering the Space Weaver 6X for purchase. I have been programmed to be the most personable and accurate navigation system on the market. Just bring me a star chart, and I shall weave my yarns into a... My yarns into a... Where are my yarns? What happened to my top spindle? Demo terminated. Service requested. Fucking dude went off. Hmm. I get the feeling something is supposed to go in this area here, but it's missing. Hmm. I get the feeling something is supposed to go in this area All here. All right, so we gotta find the whole thing for this. 
Ah, so he's so he's blocked himself off and whatnot. That's right. I wonder if the one teleporter, but we probably need like specialized equipment in order to get the uh Ice Cream did not see that coming. At least a little do these whipped cream guns come off? Not since somebody used one to blast themselves into an unauthorized area. One guy takes it too far, and we all get punished. <laughs> Not fair. <laughs> Some sort of ice cream avalanche. No, we're trying to cryogenically freeze ourselves. Some messed up junk has been going down around here, and we'd rather just sleep through it. Oh, I see. Mind if I have a look around? Knock yourself out. Just don't throw us out until things settle down, okay? We're trying to cryogen. <laughs> oh, I like this. I I'm feel not gonna lie, that one, that one fucking stuffed animal reminded me of like Fluffy and Uranus. They have the voices. Yikes. Yeah. Well, that room is gone. The whole the it looks the like ship. The windows have been sealed with some sort of force field. The shield, the 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 fucking part of the ship. The, the <laughs> there she goes, dumping the trash off the ship. I guess. If only I were a little faster. Ah, I see. I can dump something. This survived. The fucking train survived. Hi. Is there a problem here? Why are they fucking yes. crying? This train is about to go out of control. And our young hero is nowhere in sight. I blame myself. I thought he was banned. Can I ride the train? Didn't I just tell you it's a runaway? Also, no. We can't do anything without the young hero. If this train is about to go We're out of control... We're trying to cryogenically froze, freeze ourselves. No, it won't go out of control until the We're only young hero arrives. <laughs> if the train isn't a runaway until your hero arrives, and your hero is missing... Mr. Then Duck Man! The this fucking shred ah! shreds them. Do we exist? Do we even exist? You see, it's unsafe from a philosophical point of view. Why do you blame yourself? I banned the young hero for life after a reckless stunt he pulled in the course of a rescue. But now I realize he was just trying to teach us a valuable lesson about safety. You're, you're, you're a puppet. You're a puppet. How do you have, like, any autonomy? Like, you're the most primitive machine on board this ship. You are literally... Can I help? Sorry, but only the Man by two fucking thing. hexagons and shit. <laughs> you can't move your hand or your neck and probably your mouth. Without these hexagonal droids. Who is the young hero? The Lone Ranger of Branch Danger! The Big Bopper of Train Stoppers! The Young Master of Rail Disaster! Prevention! His name is Shane, and his whereabouts are currently unknown. I like that... I like that these little guys actually give a shit about Shay, and they do appreciate when he stops, like, you know. Uh-huh. I like that, you know? That's nice characterization for them. Are you sure I can't help? How do you know I'm not the young hero? The young hero has a face that shows no fear. Also, he wears periwinkle loungewear. Well, what? stay safe. Find the young hero. Only he can keep us safe. Yeah, yeah. Hey. That could work. But not while he's so... flat. 
Just wear him like a suit. I could wear him as a costume, but a that would be suit. creepy. And also, I'd probably sweat to death. The, these these would probably be like they'd probably be even like more sad. All right, I'll come back. We're just gonna, you know what? We have to find. I'm pretty sure we'll have to find something to like, you know. We have to fix Shay. Yeah. This is what's left of him. Hmm. Doesn't seem to be any way back up there. But you know, that's okay. I like having my feet on the ground. I don't think it's even active anymore, really. Nah, I don't think so either. So, we gotta t either gotta get something in there? Or toss something out of there. The garbage chute. Yeah. You gotta get hey there. there. Back to the Nexus. Are uh, you gonna make my head huge again? You haven't eaten in at least an hour, have you? Hey, my head's normal. Well, I wouldn't go so far as to say that. But at least I didn't make it any bigger this time. Oh, there was a dead moth on one of my lasers. It was messing the whole deal up. Yikes! It would have been worse. You could have ended up half girl, half moth. <laughs> Yikes! Oh, the stories I can tell, honey. So I take it something. Hello? Hey there. I knew you were faking it. Hey, I go to a more sensitive location than you two. So naturally, I'm more sensitive to power surgeons. Uh-huh. So she's gonna walk into radiation eyes, land without a suit. Down. We are going to pick up that huge generator with our bare hands. Oh, she's entering an area of strong. Trying to warn me about falling ship parts. <laughs> just, yeah, just walk inside the radiation zone. Huh. I wonder what that funny light show is for. <laughs> oh no! Man, that's pretty. Wonder what it is. Oh, that's the fusion orb. It powers the ship's defenses. Is it dangerous? Not as long as it's on ice. And if it heats up? Omicron fission event. Ooh, that sounds like an explosion. Big one. Hey, what are you up to? Oh, nothing. I just like to keep track of where all the explosives are. So let's just... Hey, this thing is neat. Oh, and hot, hot, hot! Attention! Do not remove fusion ore from refrigerated pedestal. Omicron fission event will occur. Can't take that trinket, I guess. So we're probably gonna need to set up like a timed heater. That kind of tip. We can't build the bomb, but you know what we could totally do? Turn the ship into a fucking bomb. Hey there. Oh, you want to go back to the Nexus? Wait. You could it's probably hook. Trigger to Alex's death you could probably hook that up to something. Show. Probably with the ice cream shit. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Get an automatic whipped cream launcher. Just keep that shit fucking like, you know. One guy ruins the fun and now we can't. The only thing this trigger is good for is firing Alex's death ray. And only when we're in range and I have a clear shot. Well, I can climb. Okay, now I'm cold. Don't if nothing else, me. they'll keep my feet warm in here. Don't forget about st right the cloud shoes get up the whipped cream. If my friends in Marilov can see me now. The land of ice cream. 
I'd eat some, but it smells like some sort of refrigerated nutritional paste, plus food coloring. Oh. You sure that stuff is cold enough to freeze you? Oh, yeah. It's made of some really advanced chemical compounds. What we're doing is probably much safer than eating it. Oh. Uh, so Shay's not the only well, yes. person. I will have some well, ice cream. Thank you. I guess Bella's not the only person who's gonna get cancer. I can't carry it in my hands. <laughs> He's been eating that. Oh man, that whipped cream sludge ate my cloud shoes. Sorry, uh oh. All right, so now we got presumably. You don't think we gotta put this in the fucking, like, uh... Put that in the I'm fusion... Sure. <laughs> yeah. I think we might have to put the fusion inside the thing and whatnot, you know what I mean? And that's gonna keep it cold? Hey there. Back to the Nexus? I mean, it kept those fuckers cold and whatnot, you know what I mean? So it's never melt ice yeah, cream. Thank you it's some partial, you. like, cryogenic compound. Say yes. they wanted to check out the fusion or containment facility. You haven't eaten there, I, 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 I sense horrible things in both Bella and Shay's futures. Alright. Let's go put this on ice. Cream. I wonder if this cold bowl would keep that thing from overheating. The cold bowl. Yeah, that works great. Attention, do not remove fusion ore from refrigerated pedestal. Omicron fission event will occur. Not until my super advanced ice cream melts, it won't. And when the ice cream finally melts, something tells me we'll have a nice little explosion on our hands. Speaking of, I should probably get this thing off the ship. Ah! Hey there. Oh, you want to go back to the Nexus? You have We gotta get to the kitchen. All there? Great. Yes. Now my question is, do we take the teleporter to get there? It's probably, yeah, you know what, it's probably the fastest way. Or no, no, we don't go to the kitchen. No, I think we might need some cereal or whatever. We need the, we need the helmet. We need the control helmet. Now we go in the kitchen. Alright. Turn that frown upside down. Stop. Stop right there. That's enough. Stop right there. Alright. Okay. Let's be careful this time. Now we get out of the helmet. I like how it starts us off walking into the room even though we've already in there on the helmet. Oh, whoops. I left that hanging out. Go back in, yarn arm. Oh, sorry. I was going to clean that up. I promise. I think that's enough for right now. Go, go, go. Hey, it's that little gal. There they go. They went into the other door. I know. Hi. This teleporter takes us right near the thing. Starboard passageway. Oh, honey, we need to talk about your perfume. Oh, right, yeah, we still smell like the monster. Hold that open for me. That would be a great way to get it off the ship. Shit. Hey there. Back to the Nexus. 
If we gotta, hey there. If we gotta Back run, to the maybe. Because we still remember, we'll we're a bit chatty with the teleporters and whatnot. Great. Yeah. So it might be better to just, you know, run and whatnot. Unless there's a way we can keep it open. More cereal, please. She goes. All right, go. Keep running, keep running. Run, run, go, 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 go. Hey, if only I were a little faster. What could make us faster? It's gotta be the teleporter. It's so uh, nice to do yeah. this, people. This you yeah, already. the teleporter, probably. We're carrying around a frozen nuclear, like, component. In a bowl of ice cream. It's probably like giving off like extreme dangerous More levels cereal, of radiation. There she goes. Oh, but it's fine as long as it's on ice. There's no way that the radiation could get through the uh, ice layer. Hi. Go. Fingers crossed. Ooh, that would be a great way to get it off the ship, I think. But it's locked tight. Yeah, it'd be much quicker than that. This is gonna be a brick wall. There's gotta be, there's gotta be like another way because every time. That's what we gotta do. It's so nice to do this, little people. It's gonna need to take some time to they move that platform. They'll be right there waiting oh. to get through. More cereal, please. There she goes. <laughs> Like, are you eating something? It hurt like a crunch. Oh, yeah, I'm eating like one of those, uh, new things that I've been. Shit! I went the wrong door. Come on. Come on. Go, 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 go. Hi. You haven't eaten in at least an hour, have you? No! Hold you open for me. fucking. Oh, oh, open. That trash robot shut it tight. I went through the wrong door and that fucked me up. Alright. It sealed it off behind it, too. Okay. That's both polite and like. Hey there. Mm -hmm. Alright, you know what? I, I'm glad I don't I'm glad I don't have to set that up again. Teleportation. If this was like an older one of these games, you'd know for a fact you have to like set that whole thing up again. This has got like that, you know. It reminds me of the fucking shopkeeper from uh, Monkey Island and shit. You have to follow him in order to find like the uh, treasure and shit. You know what I mean? Yeah. Quality of life shit. Yeah, yeah, go, 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 we get it. Close your eyes and don't look down. Ooh, here she comes. Warning. Objects placed I'm into the I'm Stop reading it! Put the bomb in! The Put the bomb! Put the bomb! Hey, hold that open for me, would ya? There we go. Ow. Hey! Nothing but dirty floors 
cereal for my troubles. Well, at least she left the chute open. Well, I was really looking forward to eating this ice cream, but it looks like that's not going to happen now. Mm, Bombs put away. The bomb! Holy smokes! I just dropped a bomb! I'd better get us out of here before that ice cream melts. How the heck are we gonna do that now? Hey there. Back to the next yeah. I just gotta get- I just got an achievement for that. You haven't eaten in a waste of hour, have you? Holy smokes! Bye bye I like- I like this game, but the voice direction's a little- At least for Bella's a little weak. Again, considering her performance as Adi Galia, like, hey, I Any dropped the bomb in the yet? chute. No, sorry. Want to hear how the plan is coming along? Okay. I made a bomb, and I found a way to get it off the ship. But I still hadn't figured out a way to drive the ship out of here. So we're super close. As long as you have a plan. We gotta stuff up the I can't wait to inter I can't wait to introduce him to my parents. He doesn't want any cereal. I think that will just freak her out. Oh, the freaking galaxy weaver or whatever. Oh. I don't think we can use those whipped cream guns. Oh yeah, right. It'll be a little chunky, but that'll be fine. Yeah, at least it'll. I'm pretty sure it'll. I wonder if this whipped cream could make my blow up boy more lifelike. Well, oh maybe god. Like is too strong a word, but definitely less flat, and the whipped cream doesn't leak out as fast as air. It actually patches leaks. Mr. Volta stumbled on the formula while developing his hull patch. You know, you can repair a flat tire with that stuff. It's not a good idea. That is not a healthy fucking snack. <laughs> Whipped cream is just, you know, sugar and. Alright, hey. Look who I found. Be happy, guys. Look who's here. It's. It's. Our young hero. It's the boy. Yay! I mean. It's ah! Jerry. Let's go. go again. Did someone say runaway train? Yay! We're all gonna die! <laughs> <laughs> hey, I'm so scared! Won't somebody help me? Uh... Ah! This is more entertaining <laughs> than the. <laughs> Well, 
What the fuck? This is no time to get festive garlands. We just killed the little fucking yard, dude. <laughs> We're getting shut yeah. down for life. I'm not gonna lie, it kind of looks like spaghetti, though, don't it? Yeah, the little eyes are like the meatballs. Yeah. This is kind of fucked, man. Don't we have a fork or some shit? Hey, do you need some yarn? Did someone ask if I need yarn? Why, yes, I do. Thank you. Here you go, Captain Rex. What is that table mess? It looks like it was carved up by a giant cat. The space wheeler prefers well-wound spools of yarn. Ideally served upon a fresh spindle to replace his own. The service on this ship has really gone down here. So sorry. Isn't the mother, like, knit? You have a fork, don't you? Oh yeah, right! Hey, think you could twirl this mess of yarn up for me? It's what I was born to do. Bon appetit! Much better. Ah, I see. Now it's an ad hoc spool of yarn. All right, here you go, buddy. Ford? Enjoy. My name, it's Lorraine. Lorraine, I need you to do something really important for me. I've been waiting to hear those magic words all my life. Space Weaver. Hello, and thank you for considering. Yes! Uh, that's the stuff. So, can we go somewhere now? Absolutely. Somebody had me a star chart, quick! My needles itch! So now I need to find a star chart. I'm surprised he doesn't remember the one. Right. Hey, wait a second. You don't think. It's the last girl. The one that downed our vessel. What about her? She's significant to him somehow. He was willing to risk everything for her. Twice. Do you think he found a specimen? Oh, God. Trolled the formation. Yes. I don't even think we need the other specimens. Render them all just to be safe. And incinerate the waste material after you repair the ship, Marakai. I'd rather the council not find out about how you almost managed to lose a collector in the Badlands. Yes, sir. About the mother. You know the rules, Marakai. She came into contact with an unpurified primitive. Who knows how many diseases she's carrying? Yes, Thrushmaster. I'll initiate repairs and. The incinerator. Hurry, Marakai. There's a quiver in my blood. I think he needs medication for that. Looks like some sort of video game. I'm not going any closer to that weirdo. I don't think cereal would help there. He's got a star chart over there. Looks like some kind of yeah. chart. Can't get any closer while Cadaver Face is around. Cadaver Face. I don't think cereal would help there. Hmm. I wonder if there's a panel nearby. We need, like, to distract them somehow. If only, like, the death. If only, once again, if only we could use that, like, death ray. Maybe we can go into the trophy room? Mm -hmm. We need- she said that she can't get past them? Oh yeah, right! Trophy room. Yeah. 
Because he probably didn't plug up that one hole, and he's too stupid to notice. To the junk room. Junk room. There goes nothing. Miss you already. Cadaver I'm face. I'm not going through that. Wolf cream will see me. Ah. Uh -huh. Hey, this window is clear now. I wonder... Ah! Hey, it's the non-maiden. It's Bella. My name is Bella. Oh, yes. She's from my town. The one that sprayed me with water? What's she doing out there? More importantly, can she get us some food? Huh? I'm going to get you out of there. Oh, yeah, How? It's cereal. This monster's made of metal. Oh, yeah, right. I'm working on it. Uh... Hey, I've got some cereal here, dude. Yeah, yeah, yes. Drop the... it in front of the door. I'll grab it with my hook. Hurry, please. Here's some cereal. Uh, uh, uh. Oh, thank you, Bella. Let me do it. With my hook, leave it to me. Hey, what the heck? Uh, uh, uh. God, look at the size of that rat. What? Where? I can't see it. It panicked when you hooked it and ran off. But it was as big as a cat. I told you there were rats out there. Now what are we going to eat? Here, I found some more cereal. Thanks, Bella. <laughs> what the oh, fuck? You can almost pretend it's rats. Shh, I'm having a hard enough time pretending this stuff is cereal. Oh, it's not even real cereal. I don't want to hook that. Hmm. I feel we need like we need like some string or something. Hey Mel. Hey Mel. Yeah. crossed. You don't think we could like? It's the trigger to Alex's death ray. I'm sure we're far enough. Maybe. Uh, this is a bit of a stretch. You don't think he's gonna like spare any? I don't know much about robots, but this one looks more. Probably not. This giant scar reminds me of someone. It's like a giant scar that somehow tells the ship. Prima maybe you can maybe you can go back down to the shaft and then like you know well you know what I mean. He's probably gonna panel and like you know. I don't wanna hug that. I don't wanna hug that. To use this hook on something. I don't want to hook that. No! That's the switch he used to unlock that door over there. Back when he was fake trapped. I can't get. Looks like some sort of video. Oh. What's up? Back in the trophy room, wasn't there like an open panel and whatnot that you can use? Was there? I saw a thi like. Let's head in there real quick. Hi, Mel. Back to the junk room. We must return to the junk room. something real quick sorry oh, okay. Ugh. this 
Oh no no no! The you panel was in no the open the open pathway was in which was nothing. Was it? It was in the it was in the Weaver room. Right. Oh okay. But it was blocked off by debris. I thought there was Looks a like there's a bunch button of you can push. In there. I can't get through. That would cause an alarm. Either way. Was there a button that can cause an alarm? I might be just- Hi, Mel. It's so mm. nice to deal with We might be able to deal with this next Monday. Thanks for choosing yeah. teleportation. Like, back in his room and whatnot. Merrick's room. Not your, your hey, room, Mel. Merrick. Hey, the other Mel. Merrick. Oh, yeah, right. Received some damage in the crash. Some exposed wires here, probably set off that alarm. Ah. Better do some quick repairs. Yeah, let's try. That was close. Hey, Mel. Hey. Fingers crossed. Thanks for choosing. It's so nice to de risk people. What the fuck? Oh. Thank you for traveling. Close your eyes and don't look down. Ciao. So we gotta get over to... Not the weaver, we gotta get over to the bedroom. Yep. There's probably something on the computer and whatnot, you know what I mean? Yeah. Right, we can lock him in. There, it's locked. Ah. <laughs> it's a chart with stars on it. That does it. I'm breaking that lock. Now it's perma unlocked, but we got the star chart, so we can get the fuck out of here. We might have to like cut holes in it or something, but I don't really know. Oh yeah, let's team up with the mom. It's like but she's not really doing anything. Here we go. We did all the work. Wait, pressure. Mechanism. Initializing warp and wolf drive. Intake calipers in position. Weave yeah, thrusters uh, at viscosity. Spindle at rotational velocity. This the chart I stole is a big ball wolf. Still smells kind of fishy. And do Four, I detect a whiff of beast three, cooker? Two. What? It's the chart I stole. Ah, uh, right. Try red yeah. image. Nothing happened. Affirmative. We were already located at the destination indicated by the star chart. Obviously a drill. I hope that I passed. By the arms, we have stayed put. It's the chart I stole from the big ball The wolf. red hanger. Is an easy one for the space we have to use the hook on the thing. We do. Preparing decryption mechanism. Initializing warp and wolf drive. Intake calibers in position. Leave thrusters at this situation here. Spindle at rotation. Just a velocity. quick fix. Deploying nav scarf in five. Four. Three. 
Oh god. Two. One. Try red engaged. What? Leave error. Where are you? Let's try that again. I need to get another location. I wonder... Oh, I think you can remove the stitches and whatnot. I can? Yeah. We shall be there in no time. Preparing decryption mechanism. Initializing warp and wolf drive. Intake calipers in position. Only add new stitches. We have thrusters at viscosity. And only add just new ones. One small change here. Just a quick fix. In five, Let me just make one small four, change here. Three, two, one. Master deployed. Drive red engaged. What? Hey, Merrick. Yo. I something and whatnot. It's like what a giant scar. Right? That somehow tells the ship where to go. When you go at the inventory. It's the chart I stole from the big ball wolf. Bottom right. Oh. Shay? Yeah. Oh, we gotta get a code from him, don't we? Mm, probably, yeah. Well then, you know what? I think for now... Alright. We'll save this. I'm surprised I'm surprised we don't, you know. I'm surprised that they did it like that. I guess it does I guess it makes sense, but you know what I mean? Mm-hmm. Alright. But I think for now, we'll bring this to a close for a bit. I like it. Alright. Like I like I'm I I I honestly think I guess the more complicated like the puzzle the less I can, like, overthink it. I think that's why I was getting into this one a little bit more. Because what was it? Oh, a lot of, like, the first sequence was a lot of, like, trading and whatnot. So it's like, oh, the puzzles are simple. So I'm, like, overthinking those. This, I gotta, like, put in, like, okay. So you need to find, like, all this crap. I, I don't know. I, I like the one I like the one where you had to, like, guide the robot to where, we, where it needed to be and whatnot. Mm -hmm. That was fucking cool. Let's that see. That was pretty cool. Like I said, I, I don't know. I like that. Okay, now I'm... Alright, you know what? I was gonna raid Doug if he was live. Because I owe him a, uh, whatchamacallit. You owe him a raid? I owe Not just a raid, but I owe him a freaking um... What's the name of that thing? I owe him a, uh, prime sub. From his birthday. Right. But Korra is live. But <laughs> they're playing Kingdom Hearts again. Let's go. Let's go in. All right. But Zig, do you think we learned anything tonight? Because I, I learned that I learned that I think I figured out how my brain works with puzzles. The simpler the har the simpler the puzzle, the harder I'm gonna try to like solve it and not figure it out. Yeah. <laughs> Meanwhile, the more difficult. Puzzle, I've like, learned that you can always cool down nu a nuclear uh, fusion thing is with ice cream. I I Never learned that it's safe. I learned that it's safe to touch nuclear stuff <laughs> with no repercussions at all. It's perfectly fine. But I think for now, anyway, guys, thank you guys for joining us tonight. I hope you guys enjoyed. But remember, as always, be yourselves and remember. <gasps> Mega laga hi, mega hidey ho. Mo make a chai, make a mo make a hey. Pickle barrel come quiet, shimmy cherry changa. That's the secret word of the day. All right, guys, catch you all later. Merrick out. See you guys. Good night, everybody.